Is Vino dropping clicks? Clicks and Vino just got in another huge argument, which seems to be almost a daily occurrence by now. But this time it actually led to a tweet from Vino that says, looking for a duo on EU next season, DM doesn't matter if you have a duo or not. And this is all coming off of the back of them arguing in a scrim game. But you guys have to see what clicks actually responded with after he saw this tweet. You tell your duo that you're dropping in next season. What does that, what does that make you feel like? That makes you feel like a bad player. It's meaning that What's the point? You already know you're, it just makes you feel like sh It just hurts, you know? I mean, I'm not gonna play good, bro. I never give my input about a gameplay because I always get, I always get sh on, bro. So I give my input one, one, one time, one, one, one play, I give my input. He, he leaves the room, bro. It's crazy. I'll just never get my input ever again. I'm always wrong. And honestly, you do have to feel bad for clicks. All he wants to do is win an FNCS. And I'm going to go a lot more into detail of this. But real quick before the studio starts, hitting 100,000 subscribers would be like winning FNCS to me. So if you want to help me win FNCS, please just subscribe to the channel if you guys are new and turn on notifications. We just recently hit 50,000 subscribers. So thank you guys all so much for that. I truly do love and appreciate all you guys. Use code KDOG in the Fortnite item shop for this program even more. Without further ado, though, let's get straight into this video. All right, so the thing about this duo is it's honestly really hard to tell the difference between when they are content farming and when one of them is genuinely upset and i feel like clicks is this time genuinely upset about it but he just has to do it in a way that is content farming so it doesn't look like he is getting his feelings hurt too much but honestly if you have been watching the streams recently every single time that they die vino does just blame it on clicks it's always clicks his fault clicks isn't allowed to give his opinion on literally anything without vino just team blaming him and i can't lie that would be super annoying to have to play with all of the time you have to remember though that these dudes do live together though and clicks is allowing vino to live with him for completely free all expenses paid for clicks has also said on his stream that, that he pays for dinner for both of them multiple times a week and that vino is kind of just taking advantage of his kindness right now obviously though right now is the best that clicks has ever been performing in fortnite since probably like world cup he has been placing top five in all of the fncs qualifiers placing top five in the recent dual cash cup winning weeks of fncs finals this duo honestly does look absolutely insane with all the turmoil that they have gone through throughout the season let me know in the comment section down below though if, if you would be able to put up with the yelling that vino does if it means you would have a higher chance to place well in fncs because that is pretty much what clicks is giving up right now all of his old duos like epic whale scented dukes they were all a lot nicer and they even when they weren't placing as well they were still very friendly with each other but even with how good clicks and vino are placing vino is just never satisfied as a player and he is never satisfied as a person i feel like that is just the type of person that vino is though and that is honestly a big difference that a lot of people are seeing now between eu and na players like most of the na players are super friendly with each other they'll all hang out outside of streaming and outside of fortnite and like play basketball together all those sort of things but then you look at eu and it is the complete opposite you have the top tier players like tayson saying that he doesn't want to be friends with his duo because it is supposed to be like a business and as soon as you are too close with your duo you guys become complacent to bad results and honestly i have to partially agree with that because if you're friends with someone you're not going to be able to be completely honest with them and tell them the truth because you don't want to hurt their feelings but that is honestly the exact opposite of what vino is and that a lot of the clicks viewers are just going to have to get used to that if they want to see clicks be able to win an fncs or if they want to see clicks be able to qualify for the LAN event this is by far clicks best chance he is ever going to have to be able to win an fncs and the part that they were even arguing about today wasn't even as serious as some of the other things they've argued about in the past i'm going to show the clip on the screen right now and i can basically give you guys some more context afterwards because you keep antagonizing them you edited four the times we're gonna key us no matter what what the f man they hit us 190 that's the same team that hit us 190 we'll hit you 190. Yeah. it was 45 seconds ago a minute ago and i was back to they're still gonna key us. They, hit, they hit me 20 hp bro if I give them more search, if I give them more search, they weren't, they were actually weren't gonna keep me. So I mean, yeah, this was basically what caused the whole argument. If you saw the play that actually happened, it really wasn't even anything that serious. I don't even know why it ended up escalating to the point where Vino was talking about a looking for duo tweet. But we recently just saw Vino and Clicks make up on stream for like the hundredth time. Now I'm gonna show that clip as well. Don't read my chat, bro. They're just, they're, hey, we good? Was it? Yo, hey, okay, this is really getting zesty. Come on, don't do it. Don't do the kiss part, please. Hey, actually, don't. Please, come on, bro. Like, they already think I'm coming out, bro. Don't, dude. All right, so it wasn't any. It wasn't any of our faults. No, nah, it wasn't. Nah. Like that. nah, bro. We could have a little hug. Got you, bro. 
So, I mean, for all of the Clicks viewers out there that are saying that Clicks should drop Vino and that Vino is just way too toxic for him, I completely disagree. At this point in Clicks' career, the only thing he really has left to accomplish is winning an FNCS. And if he truly wants to accomplish that goal, he needs to play with somebody like Vino. He needs to play with someone that is going to yell at him, be strict with him, give him this type of, like, you have to perform at your top level performance or we're not going to be playing together. And, like, they don't care that he's Clicks. They don't care that he's famous. They don't care how rich he is, anything like that. It's someone that just wants to win and Vino is the perfect person for him. I definitely do think that Vino should lighten up a little bit on him sometimes because he is super, super strict with him literally 24 seven, it seems like. But if Clicks truly wants to win, maybe that is just what it is going to take. And at the end of the season, if they're able to win an FNCS, no one will even say anything about this. No one will care how Vino treated Clicks all season or anything like that. But if they end up placing bad this season and they're not even able to qualify for the LAN event or anything, it would probably go down as one of the most disappointing seasons of all time in Fortnite history. History, the amount of hype that this duo has right now and just the amount of content that they have been making clicks is back to being probably by far the biggest content creator in fortnite he, but this is the season that everyone is saying that clicks actually has a chance to really win fncs and they have been saying that for over six years now but to me personally this, this is definitely the season that i feel like it could get done another thing with vino saying that he's looking for a duo next season the next fncs we're gonna have doesn't even start until like january or february so that would be a very long time away it could not even be a thing of like him just not wanting to play play with clicks it could just be a thing of he's just going to be moving back to europe in six months because after this season we have the land event next season so there's no like fncs qualifiers it's just the land event then we go back to og chapter two fortnite and then by then it is going to be january or february by the next time that we actually have fncs starting up again so it is uncertain how long a lot of these eu players are going to be living in na but i just really wouldn't look too deep into that tweet honestly and i don't think that vino is going to drop clicks for this season or for the land event obviously since they're already in heats and they are a grand finals favorite let me know if you guys think if this is clicks this season to win an fncs or not in the comment section down below other than that though let me know also your guys' thoughts on just all this drama that has been going on recently between clicks and vino let me know if you guys think it is just a content farm or if you think that this is a serious situation and this could lead to the downfall of clicks and vino heading into fncs qualifiers and possibly heading into grand finals as well other than that though subscribe to the channel if you guys are new thank you guys all so much for the support recently if you guys want to help me win fncs like hopefully clicks coming with FNCS this season please subscribe to the channel if you guys are new remember if i'm one day able to get that youtube plaque it would mean the absolute world to me you guys are all like family thank you guys all so much for the support recently use go kid dog in the fortnite item shop thank you guys all so much for watching the channel thank god for another day i'm gonna have a bunch of videos coming out super soon for the little break that we have between now and fncs heats because if you guys don't know fncs heats don't start for another three weeks as of the time i'm recording this video so we have a pretty long break between now and fncs but don't worry i have a bunch of video ideas that i have and i'm going to be dropping them all super soon other than that though hope you guys enjoyed catch you guys next time peace out